guys, so in this video, I'm going to be showing the things that I got for my altar. This is just a small portion of it. Obviously, I'm going to be adding more because of the size that my altar actually is. I will tell you where I got my altar. Um, we were having a community yard sale in my neighborhood, and the neighbors across the street had a shelf, and it was 15 bucks, but we got it for 10 um, they just wanted to get it off their hands, but it was brown, so I spray painted it black, which you'll see in a video later on once I get done spraying it. Um, I got it completely black, but we're wanting to take like a brown and kind of spray over it to kind of bring like the black and brown out, kind of like this thing is. Um, and it's going to be going over here. You'll see all that, and I still have to create the altar cloth but I can show you what I have for the altar cloth. Okay, this is an old sheet. And actually I take old sheets that I don't use anymore and I create things with them. And I actually have a pillow. I actually have a pillow just like this. So we figured we would do that and I've got lace to go with it. So here's the altar cloth. Obviously it's going to be smaller because I still have a lot of the sheet left, but I thought it would be great for it. And we're going to end up putting another altar cloth on top of that with a moon on it, but we wanted one just for right now. So let's begin. You haven't seen this. If you've been on my TikTok, you've seen this. I did post about it, but um, it's just a little chest. Um, the clip itself is kind of wobbly or whatever but I'm pretty sure that that can be easily fixed if not then it's fine I got it for $2.99 at the Goodwill it's just a little chest I'm gonna end up painting this and putting it kind of similar to the altar itself I guess I don't know I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do with it yet but I may just paint it so if you have any ideas you know, Pinterest ideas, put them in the comments below. That would be great. But uh, this is going to hold all our crystals. And then when we were at Goodwill a while ago, we got these candle holders. We really like this one. I feel like it's perfect for just putting a tiny candle in or having one that comes up above it. And then my wife saw these two. They're just candle holders that match. We like them. We got the candle holders for a dollar. I think this one was a dollar as well. Um, if you haven't figured out, my wife and I will be sharing an altar. We are bounded by hand fasting, so it makes life a lot easier. Now, when we were at Five Below, I did have the case for it. My dogs chewed up the case, but this little tiny pot actually has rose stuff in it and I'm gonna do a video of the process of this eventually I don't know when I may I may but talking about that I got this also at five below it is a lavender and chamomile thing it's like a tin and it's got all of the goodies inside of it the seeds and the growth and stuff I'm going to put this on the altar as well, and obviously when it needs to be out in the sun, I'll put it in the sun by my window, and then it will go back in the altar, but this will probably be on the second shelf, hopefully. I don't know. I may put this on the altar. We'll see, but I just loved it, and on top of that, I love the tin. If I don't want to use the tin for the actual lavender and chamomile, I will probably end up using this tin for something on the altar. And then we're pretty, this is fake, but I just saw it at Dollar Tree. And the joke behind this is, yes, it's a fake succulent. And yes, I'm going to put it on the altar. The joke behind it is um, my wife got a real succulent and my cat, my old cat, um, he ended up being an outside cat and found a new family type thing. He's fine, but... He liked to attack the succulent a lot. 
and we would try everything <laughs> to stop him from attacking the succulent and digging the dirt and all that stuff. Well, the succulent died. And, well, this is just the inside joke of it, that I found her a fake one that she can't get killed and our cat cannot attack. That I know of. The cat hasn't attacked it. It's been up here. <laughs> um, we're gonna put this crystal. Honestly, I'm sorry. I can't figure out what kind of crystal it is. I can't remember. But it came in a little thing. I got it at Spencer's and I got it for my wife. But this is going to be on it, and obviously there's going to be more crystals that I do have. Now this is my favorite thing. This was at Five Below. It is a wall mirror. A crescent moon wall mirror. I love it. We actually have another quote thing that's kind of... I'll show you in a minute. I'll show you the corner. But, um... This is going to go above the altar. Obviously, I haven't peeled off the thing. I haven't opened it up. I'm waiting until I design the altar itself and put this up. And then we got this at Goodwill. My wife really loved it. I guess it's a incense candle holder thing. But uh, she really liked it. She wants to paint it, but the thing is, is on the altar, I want it to be both us. So... Mine would be pink and black, and then she likes green and blue, so I told her just to keep it the way it is, that it's not going to bother me. Because I'm very OCD about things matching, but with an altar, if I'm sharing it with somebody that has different tastes than I do, then obviously I'm not going to say anything. But, uh, yeah, we got this for $1.99. She really loved it. Now, this last thing, I don't know, and you've seen it in my videos back here. I don't know if I'm going to put it on the altar, but I wanted to show it anyways, because it's cute. We got this at Kroger around Halloween. This is Quitch Witchin. Sorry, it's backwards because my camera is facing towards me. But uh, this was $4.99. That is everything that I currently have for the altar. I'm so excited to design this. Um, I've been working hard on making sure that I'm keeping up with it and not letting it die on top of that the shelf's huge so it's easily you know one of those things that I can't forget about it <laughs> but uh you'll see the video of me actually spray painting the altar creating the altar cloth pretty much everything is semi homemade um I feel like that's more connecting so yeah be on the lookout for that video bye you guys Thank you.